Jesus says, War drums are beating in heaven, and my plans for your loved ones. January 25, 2016 Words from Jesus to Sister Claire Spoken by Jackie Jesus began, War drums are beating in heaven. In heaven? Oh yes, they beat, for my Father's heart is sickened by what the enemy has done to his people and creation. He is sick of the suffering of the innocent and is preparing an end for the wicked. This is every bit as much a spiritual battle as it will be in the physical. There will be rescues, spectacular supernatural rescues, because of your prayers, my brides. Yes, judgment must come to earth, but my heart is soft for my bride, and I have hearkened to her prayers for her families. I wish for you all to be at peace, that I am faithful, and have noted down all of your tears for your families. Angels are already assigned. So much mercy will be granted the loved ones of my bride, because she of all people has been hardest hit with family members. She has been targeted, and while free will still has the last say, I know how to move on the hearts of men. Is it not written the king's heart is in the hand of the Lord? as the rivers of water. He turns it wherever he will. Proverbs 21.1 That stands for those who are dear to you also. Thank you, Lord. I know so many will be relieved to hear that. There is nothing easy about what is yet to come. But I do not want the hearts of my loved ones distracted by the fate of family members. Remember that I love them more than you ever possibly could, and I never give up, even on the hardest hearts. You may take solace in the fact that the rapture will jar many into the reality they've been avoiding. There is preparation in the hearts of your loved ones that I have done. You cannot see or hear it, but I've laid a foundation of sorts, so that when confirming events happen, the heart shell will indeed be broken, and they will give their lives to me with much remorse. One of the greatest things you can do to prepare them is to be exceptionally loving and forgiving. That carries a sweetness that is the key to anyone's heart. The worst thing you can do is to preach condemnation and hell. You would be surprised how many already know they are headed towards hell, but simply can't bring themselves to the point where they are willing to change. The rapture will change that. It will be solid proof that I exist. Hell is real and just as real as you were only moments before when I removed you from earth. The harder part for me, Claire, is the lives that will be lost during the catastrophes and wars. Lives of souls that never repented, never cared about anything but the body's needs and never had time for me, as you were musing while I was speaking to you, and you didn't know it. All soldiers are inoculated with a chip that affects the way they think. Not only does the culture in the armed forces shape a man, there also is now a chip that affects their sensibilities about me and about love. There are exceptions to the rule, but the fact is, it is much harder for them to get in touch with the more delicate and spiritual feelings. Don't you know I don't leave them on their own, 
but override this device? Nonetheless, it has an impact. There is no soul I abandon to the deceits of the governments, not one. I find a way to touch them. I find a way to bring my light into the darkness of their minds. Those who read the scriptures daily are strengthened and cleansed, just like everyone else. I thought to myself when he said that, Why are you telling me these things, Lord? Why am I telling you these things? Because they weigh heavily on my heart, beloved. I share them with you because you are my spouse and I want you to understand some of what I must deal with each day. Wars are being waged in the heavenlies right now to bring souls to me at this last hour. Much that is taking place in migration has shaken the very foundations of life and caused them to cry out to me more than ever. I'm touching them with my love. They are clinging to me as never before and there is a harvest to be had in their camps. All of this is part of my plan to use the evil the enemy has planned to do good and bring the lost home to me. Keep your focus, my brides. Keep your hearts solely for me, that our reunion may be a joyful one.